Tomorrow, the Board of Supervisors will discuss a request for an independent investigation over concerns that Sheriff Chris Nanos failed to conduct a timely and thorough investigation into the alleged sexual assault of a female deputy by her superior. News for Tucson's Lupita Murillo has more. This memo, dated September 13th, was a request made by Supervisor Sharon Bronson of District 3 for tomorrow's meeting for the board to discuss. Bronson told News 4 Tucson she's receiving calls from constituents about the case. Our citizens need to know that we are public and we are transparent. And the best way to determine whether or not what happened happened in a timely manner is to have an outside agency investigate. Sheriff Chris Nanos responds. There are elected officials as I am. And if they think there's some improprieties over here, then that's within their right. Sergeant Don Barkman is the vice president of the Pima County Deputies Organization. They released a statement last week questioning the sheriff's decision about putting on hold the internal investigation into his chain of command. Her chain of command let her down. They didn't take care of her. They let her be continually, repeatedly sexually assaulted inside the residence while they stood outside and did nothing. That's questioning the integrity of those young officers and young commanders who were there. And that is what's really discouraging. That's, that's, that's disgraceful because that is not what happened. The victim made an online complaint against her command staff in July, seven months after the incident. Sheriff Nano says the criminal investigation takes precedence over the internal investigation. We've never put a internal investigation on until the criminal matter is resolved. And the criminal investigation is about Ricky Garcia and what he did and he's already been arrested for that. The chain of command is not facing any criminal charges. Parkman tells me the Sheriff's Department is not giving the public a clear picture of who was there and what happened at the party. And I think the public needs to know that, how untruthful he's being. I'm saying the union's a liar, if that's what they're saying. No, I'm not lying. Sheriff Nanos tells News 4 Tucson once the criminal portion is over, he will conduct an internal investigation if needed. The meeting is scheduled for Tuesday morning, Reporting from the newsroom, Lupita Murillo, News for Tucson.